You got more? There's aisles over here. There's a whole bunch of the choir up there. Go get the messages to them. You want to show your mom what your message says, huh? Okay. You can take those home, and this is the job of an angel, to be a messenger for God, to tell us what God has in God's heart for us. How you doing? You got a couple? Can I have the last one? Thank you very much. Looks like they all got handed out. Now here's what we get to do. With, okay, we've got one, you've got one, you can keep that one. All right, come on back, angels, come on and have a seat. Who in the congregation is willing to stand and read one of their messages of what they got? Go ahead, you stand and read and tell us nice and loud what your message says. Say that again. Have hope in all things. Wonderful, that's an angel. Deliver that message from God to you this day. Who else has a different one? Go ahead and read yours. God's grace means you are accepted. God's grace means you are accepted. Thank you, angels, for giving that message out to somebody. What does yours say? God, God believes in you. Wow, that's a really good message. Which one do you have down there? Forgiveness is given to you now, folks. The angels gave you all a message. Now your job is to be an angel to somebody else. If you have a message sitting in your hand, you've already read it for you, take your message and hand it to somebody else and let them hand that message to you so you get a brand new message about what God has to say for us. Give it to somebody else. This is God's message to us all the time, that God's love is for us. The job of anybody who is an angel is to tell us what God's message and love is for us. And so thank you, angels, for your job. Thank you for flying around in this world. Thank you for being caring for other people. Thank you for love that never ends and telling us about what God asks us to do and be and the love God gives us in our life. On those final words, everybody, let's all say amen together. Here we go. Amen. Amen.